Hey everyone, welcome back to Passion of the Healing Carol. Back at it again with a big car. As you can see by the title, this is Are You Pregnant at this current moment? Before we hop into it, remember to take what resonates, leave the rest. This is the general reading. It will not resonate for every single person out there. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for all for more content here. Let's go ahead and get into it. So for pile one, we have this yellow flower on top. For pile two, we have the rip track. Uh, for pile three, we have the glam hair pin. For pile four, we have a gold money coin and for uh pile five we have some sage here uh so go ahead and use your intuition tune in if you have to pause the video please do so all right pile one are you currently pregnant at this time we have star keeper cosmic ancestor see the light by staying grounded king of pentacles the ten of pentacles the nine of swords and then we have control yes you are um i feel like for most of you you might like not want this you might be disappointed i do feel like someone trapped you here uh, most definitely someone got what they wanted what they wished here uh, for other of you you just feel like it's the wrong time for you to be here um, I also feel like your baby will be opposite of what you want. So say for instance, you are a want to go girl, um, it might actually be a boy and vice versa here. Um, I'm also seeing that for some of you, your family might like disagree with this. Others of you, they're going to be really, really supportive here. So just kind of take what resonates. I feel like for like a wide range of you that you know, which side your family like would be on here um you could have pets here um as well so you could already feel like you have like children to take care of for some of you um others of you your um child um, it's going to fit in well um, with the environment that you are already in here with your um, pets and things of that nature here. I um, also heard like this pregnancy, like um, your like areolas, like you're really going to have problems with your areolas. I know for a lot of different pregnant women, different signs and symptoms and things are different. Some people have none. Some people don't even know that they're pregnant until like five months in. But I feel like for some of you, this is two months you're at. For some of you, this is seven months. For some of you, you're hitting that one month here. Um, so those are kind of like the months that I'm getting here. Um, I feel like for a majority of you as well that you're going to um, be past your due date here. Your child is going to be past their due date, so they're going to have to be forced to come out here. Um, yeah, so some of you might go over a little bit of nine months, you might hit 10 months and then you have to, again, uh, baby has to get forced out. Um, I do feel like your partner, whoever has trapped you in this pregnancy, um, will be there, but I don't, I'm not sure about a relationship because I feel like for the most part is you're the one who doesn't want it here. Um, this could be vice versa, so take it how it resonates here. Um, I feel like this baby will be born in the nighttime as well here. You could also be up during the nighttime. You could have a lot of insomnia here. I do feel like your child will be a very old soul. Like, they will be an old soul here. They might come out and surprise you. They might, like, be more into the music you were into or even before your own time. Um, <laughs> so I get a lot of what you know about that, um, energy. I do feel like it's going to be a very, very, very healthy pregnancy too, despite it probably being past your due date and things of that nature here. Uh, I think your baby is just going to like, you know, being, you know, comfortable and warm in your urine and just taking in all the good nutrients and stuff. But again, Star Keeper Cosmic Ancestor, see the light by staying grounded. Keyword, see. I 
also feel despite like some of you feel like it's the wrong timing it's actually like the right timing here um your higher self could have been ready for your spirit baby your higher self could have knew this and stuff your spirit guides and everything um your spirit team was behind you here it was about time for this to happen here for you um whether you were going to be with this partner um or not like it was meant to like or destined to um be with this person or happen at this time I also feel like for a lot of you that you will bounce back to the way that you desired here um, after or even during um, this pregnancy here. Um, so it could be a lot of things that you guys are worried about, but I feel like you guys are going to be just fine. Just fine, 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 fine. <laughs> um, Some of you might have a home pregnancy where you have a you have this queen or king chair in your home, just this single uh, love seat or just chair here. Some of you might like the water might break right then and there. Um, you might not make it to the hospital. You might have to have it there. Um, for others of you, you will be at the hospital and they can. They have to be forced. Some of you might have a C-section. Um, I'm seeing as well. Those of you who will be having a C-section, I feel like your scars are going to be pretty much healed fast and also clear up. So you won't really see that, you won't really know that you were, you know, cut there. For a lot of you, your baby's going to be quite spiritual here, and they're going to be the ones to wake you up here. I'm seeing. So that's interesting. A lot of you, this baby is your motivation here. Some of you could have been, like, ready to give up um, on life, um, or you didn't know what direction you should take um, in life, and I feel like it's... Um, your child will give you a lot of guidance here. Lots of guidance. For some of you, this is... Um, your baby has been a part of your past life for quite some time here. They could have been uh, related to you differently. And another time, for instance, some of you, your child was your parent in a previous lifetime. I'm not sure if it was a, a recent one or maybe some other ones. But that's the vibe I'm getting for some of you. Your child was your parent in another lifetime here. Um, so maybe the life, certain things are working out this way. Let's get a card from the Naked Truth Tarot. The power and are you currently pregnant at this moment? We cl uh, clarify yes. Any other energy surrounding us? Hmm. I heard iron, some of you, your iron could be low. Um, you guys might eat on a lot of ice here. Uh, some of you could have a lot of fear here as well. But again, I'm getting that everything you're just fine. We also have fear. We have reality check here. So some of you, you know here, but you're trying to deny it or you're in denial here. Uh, some of you, this could have just been your intuition here. Some of you, you took a pregnancy test. Then after that, you took like two, three, four more, you know, and they keep on telling you, you like, that's it. And you're just looking for that negative um let's see one more card <laughs> clarity truth you're moving forward you got some new beginnings here yep and guess what this is gonna balance you out though so it's just a beautiful thing it's a blessing here ah look at the bottom of the deck this can't be made up a move flower <laughs> Oh my gosh, what? For some of you, I feel like your baby could be a uh, air sign, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini here. You could be giving birth around that time here. Uh, Gemini in June, Libra is like September, October. Uh, 
Aquarius is like, you know, February, January, February. So any of those months here that I'm saying you could be um, giving birth. I just want to look at this card one more time because it just came out like that. We got a seed again. Two cards um, saying seed here. So definitely. So definitely the majority of you are in the beginning stages of pregnancy again. I heard one month, two months. And then we have for we have sage fertility um, immortality and twins. Um, so again, that's clarifying that I feel like um, it will be a very very healthy baby here. Um, I also feel like your your child will be like a picky eater here. Um, don't be surprised if they like resist certain foods here, especially unhealthy foods, because they're gonna you could be eating healthy for them right now, or they're just gonna come out wanting to eat healthy here. I'm feeling. I'm also hearing that uh, water bottle or, you know, cool water, especially at night for you, mom, would be good to keep on hand, especially if you have those night sweats and things of that nature. You could just kind of give yourself a ch -ch -ch really quick here. Um, if you, you know, have to turn the air conditioner or the fan off at night so you don't have to run it all the time so you don't get a cold or anything like that, you could, like, substitute for different things or just keep you, like, a cool, cold towel or something like that. Um... Yeah, I feel like for a lot of you, you're going to be big too. Like, your belly is going to be, ooh, you know. But surprisingly, again, you guys are bouncing back. Um, so for some of you, that could be happening now. We're just poking out. Um, <laughs> others of you, uh, it will get there here pretty soon. And then what I break into, disclose. So again, I feel like for a lot, a lot of you, um, you are attracted by your partner here, even if you guys are already like married and you have a good relationship going on here, it is still good then that this person attracts you. It doesn't have to be for every single person out there. This is your original reading, so let's keep that in mind. So again, for good listeners, if you feel like this card doesn't resonate for you at all, please choose another one. We got four more different piles here. Um, mm, 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 mm. The smell of lavender or lavender could be very significant here. Um, maybe treat yourself to some yellow flower or something. I do feel like this baby is going to have you guys very, very, very exhausted here. So make sure you guys get some good rest here. 13, 13 synchronicity on screen here. I do feel like you guys are going to go through a lot of changes again with your areolas here to change colors here, be very sore here. Um, you guys are going to be really glowing here. I'm getting like really glowing. <laughs> Hence why we have like the yellow flower like this. It's all in glowing. You're really glowing here. Okay. But I feel like you guys are going to feel every single movement here. Uh, if not already, every single movement of your baby in your stomach here, like you're going to feel like you know, everything is expanding and moving and kicking and stuff like that. And I also feel like your child will be very um, active and um, an extrovert. Uh, for the majority of you, I'm getting a boy here, a boy, a boy. Um, so that's pretty much what I have here. I'm just so excited for this pile. I can't really even think of anything else. I um, hope I'm not leaving anything out here. Um, but I did answer the initial question, so I at least want to do that. Pile one, I hope this gave you clarity. I hope you got something out of that. Thank you much for also stopping by. I hope to see you around some other time. Okay, peace. Okay, pile two, welcome to your reading club. If you chose to flap uh, your stick, flap stick, or whatever you want to call it. Are you pregnant at this time? I've seen four for four. Um, synchronicity so I kind of connect this card as like a marriage card or a relationship here and someone in the background could be jealous of it um, 
or be happy for it. This kind of depends on what other cards are surrounding. We have the Queen of Swords. We have the Four of Cups. We have the Empress. The Hangman in Reverse. We have the World card. And we have the Great Seven Lives Energy Conflict talking to us. Yes, you are currently putting your Empress on, my dear, my love, my sweetheart. Baby Boo. I heard Baby Boo. You guys might like the song Baby Shark Doo 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 Doo. Or you guys can play that for. Uh, for your children here, uh, I do feel like you guys are very um, nurturing, very caring, very like you guys could rub your stomach around here. <laughs> so I feel like a lot of you already know here. Some of you could be in denial, just like pile one, uh, a little bit in denial here. Um, I also feel like for you guys, um, this is not what you wanted at this time or probably with the person here. Um, for a lot of you, I feel like this is giving you a lot of exhaustion. It's kind of giving you a lack of motivation at this time here. I also feel like a lot of you like to look at yourself here. Uh, so you can spend hours in the mirror looking at yourself in the stomach or just looking at yourself, uh, which is very cute and beautiful. I like it. Um, but yeah, a lot of rumbling, tumbling in your womb area here. Definitely there's a baby present here. Um, I also feel like your child is going to be very chubby and cute here. Uh, I do feel like a, a lot of gossip surrounding this here, but I get it in a more so like positive way. Like people are going to be shocked by this pregnancy. Like, oh my gosh, I didn't even know you were having sex. <laughs> so some people could view it as, a, as like a food or like a virgin or whatever the case is for innocent. Like, oh my gosh, this is like, you know, everybody's going to be talking on this here. Um, there is a sense of jealousy here. This could be um, maybe one of your the person who's gotten you pregnant one of their exes or something like that or maybe the ex of yours here is going to be like quite jealous and you know crying about the situation here but i feel as though you and your person are going to be very happy about this here so i love that here um again we got that as the first card here you see those two here just happily in love and enjoy here i feel like for you guys um it will be ooh. Some of you are having twins, girl and boy. Some of you are just having a girl here. I'm seeing as far as the gender here. So, um, yeah. I do feel like this baby is going to cause you to step into your authentic self. Or at least put your foot down and stop being a people pleaser here. Like once this could be for you or your person or even both of you. Like this baby is going to have you like, you know, like you have the world in your hands. Um, I just I want to cry for this child. It's giving you a very, very beautiful nature here. Like this baby is going to be everything to you here. You're going to be very protective over your um, child. And so is your um, person, your partner here, um, the father here. Um or um whatever switch the roles and how whatever it needs to be here um i do feel, feel like for a lot of you you will be having a baby in the winter months here um you can have um sagittarius scorpio um libra or virgo uh children here um some of you even um capricorn here has some signs here um, I heard googly eyes. I feel like your child eyes could be like very big and glossy here. Or when you look into your child eyes, it's like something is gonna like switch here. Your art, your heart is gonna be pumping here. Your heart chakra is gonna be opening up even more wider. This child is causing your heart chakra to open up wider here. Um, I feel like once you guys find out the news, nineteen nineteen synchronicity. You're going to jump for joy. Um, you're going to dance, happy dance, you and your partner here. Um, I feel like majority of you, like, know it. Again, but they're probably in denial. Some of you um, don't know it or didn't know until you were, like, four, five months pregnant or something like that. Um, For a lot of you, I feel like the baby is going to be very hard to conceive here. 
they might grind you down there. Some women have that symptom. Some of you might poop on your baby when giving birth, so maybe be cautious and careful around that. Um, I feel like uh, for you, you're really going to be the mom that, you know, your baby causes stretch marks here, and there's nothing wrong with that here um, at all here. You might even find this sexy. Your person might even find this very sexy here. Um, I do feel like you're going to be eating a lot of probably sweets or like a lot of ice cream here during this time. I do feel like you will be able to cut your baby's umbilical cord. You might want to here, and I feel like you will get that chance, that opportunity to do that here. Or you might have the father um, or your partner here do it. Um, I also feel like you will be financially stable around the time that you conceive. So some of you could be worried about that, but I'm seeing there's no need to worry about that here. Um, you're going to get all the support you need here. Um, it's probably not from family, but I feel like it will be from your, you and your partner. Like you and your partner are in this together. I, that's all I'm really seeing right here. Here, I'm hoping that for the majority of you are likely that you are having family support from their end or your end. Um, but either way, I'm seeing some type of um, support. I do feel like this baby will also bring you and your partner together. So some of you, your partner, you and your partner could be separated right now. And then you don't know you pregnant or you or you guys know you're happy about it but um, there's some type of obstacle to where you guys aren't able to actually be with one another at this time but i do feel like this baby is going to bring you guys together um it's going to maybe um help you to drop the grudge towards your person or them to drop the grudge towards um you um a lot of you like this baby is also going to cause you a glow up. Not saying y'all weren't looking good back then. <laughs> Excuse my language, because you was. But for some of you, it's making you thicker <laughs> than a sucker or something. Or you're like, you know, mm, the breasts. Like, you might already have big breasts or maybe you don't. But the breasts are like, even, you know, like, okay. It's, I don't know. But, okay, goddess energy for this pile. I'm definitely getting. I'm also getting a lot of hair growth. Um, here so you guys can be picking prenatals here or you don't even have to the baby is just causing your hair to grow here um, and but yeah I also feel like um, <laughs> your smell you might be sensitive to smell here but I also feel like your scent within itself is very good especially during this pregnancy here so your partner could fall in love with that you could even be in love with that like you just smell beautiful um, I just heard 10 days, so some of you, this is very, very, like, early on. You could have just had sexual intimacy 10 days ago, and it's already, de like, things are developing, getting ready, um, until you can actually notice that you are pregnant. Uh, and again, the others of you, it's like four or five months that I'm getting here as a timing. Um, some of you, this might be three months here. So, um, that's the timing I'm, I'm getting here. I also heard nuts, so nuts could be really good for you in your pregnancy, give you a lot of protein or something like that. Um, also feel like some of you, you could be getting your baby or your child baptized once, you know, they come, um, once you conceive them and maybe a few months later. <clears throat> Or some of you might have a water birth here. I'm getting. Some of you might have uh, your birth in front of a fireplace here. Some of that. Some of you that could be like your like desire or fantasy so i'm not sure who that's for or this could be to where you can't get to the hospital and that's where you have to have it like you like feel comfortable like being on the floor here and you want to be next to the fireplace maybe you want to be very warm um so that's what i'm getting here um can i get any more energies or clarifiers here for pile two are they currently pregnant at this moment we answered that but let's see what else could be possibly going on here i 
her daddy, 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 daddy. Your baby's first thing or your child's first words might be daddy. Some of you moms could be like, oh no, I want to see mom or something like that. But yeah, it might be daddy. <laughs> um, look at that. We have embraced. I told y'all y'all was getting thick, thick and everything. Some of you might work with rose quartz during your pregnancy here or that could be a good stone to work with during your pregnancy. Make sure you give yourself a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of self-love. I feel like you guys are going to be attracting a lot of people here. So, like, don't be surprised if a lot of people want to hold your baby or even before you have your baby. They just want to, like, touch you, be next to you, smell you, like, talk about your pregnancy, be in the presence of you, smile at you for no reason. Or just, it is a reason you're having a child, smile at you. Um, men could also be attracted to you. Um, your pregnancy here or how you look um during your pregnancy um especially your partner here i feel like for some of you to have a lot of headaches during this time here so i heard to watch i also heard watch what you eat here so make sure you're eating healthy here um and make sure you're not mixing certain medicines here that don't um go together um, or that can cause different kind of symptoms and stuff like that if put together I'm getting as well I'm also getting to drink plenty of water here some of you also will probably conceive your baby during a vacation here um, so you might have your child in a totally different hospital you've never been at um, uh, or just something like that you guys are also protected. Remember in the beginning of the reading, I seen the synchronicity 444. So a lot of you are protected here by the divine here. Um, I also feel like the divine is like working in the background for your next pregnancy. So you, you might be pregnant now and then you conceive your baby. You might have another child right after that, like back to back. Like the divine is like... We're ready for you to have children, and we want you to have it back to back. Some of you could be older in age, elderly here, and uh, maybe your clock is ticking, or maybe you feel like your clock is ticking here, and like the divine is like, come on, push out these divine babies. <laughs> um, but yes, you are very, very protected here. A lot of you, um, your spirit could have been protecting you and others from not knowing that you were pregnant at this time, um, because you can have a lot of people in the background who are like, not wanting this for you or jealous hating um, um or they could have been evil eyeing whether intentionally or unintentionally and it could have caused harm uh to your baby so don't want to have that i also feel like for those of you who will be having your um baby in the hospital or just overall i do feel like um the people are who are helping you and guiding you through the pre pregnancy will be very helpful here um They might even be too helpful that some of you might feel like a little bothered because they might keep on constantly check on, keep checking on you or something like that. Um, <laughs> but overall, I'm getting a beautiful energy. So for a pile two, I hope they gave you clarity. I hope you guys took out of that. Thank you much. Love for dropping by, and I hope to see you next time. Okay, peace. Okay, pile three. Welcome to your readings, love. You chose the glam hair pin. Are you currently pregnant at this time? So we got hidden messages, baby girl, seven pentacles, nine of wands here, four of cups here, five of swords here, the four of swords here, and star family. So no, I'm getting a no for you guys, but I do feel like your spirit baby is very close to you, giving you messages here. Uh, some of you could be catching on to the messages. Some of you are not. Some of you are ignoring the messages like you notice it's there. But you could have a little spirit around it here. Maybe you're not that connected to the spirit realm. Um, or you feel like you're you're a little unsure if you could trust it. Like if it's actually your spirit baby or something else here. But I definitely see it's your spirit baby here. They And I also feel like they won't be ready for you anytime soon. Because some of you I'm hearing uh, two years three years, four years, five, seven, nine, um, like they're no one there ready for you. Some of you could be quite young here or they're just not going to be ready for you for a very while here. But I do feel like they are one of your spirit guides that are mainly, like mainly guiding you 
For some of you, you could have had a miscarriage or an abortion here, and that is the child that it hurts, you know, guiding you. Um, much love, blessings, and healing sent your way if that is your situation here. Um, but yeah, for some of you that that resonates more with a miscarriage or an abortion, I do feel like that spirit lady here is trying to find another spirit lady here to come along with them to be conceived um, through your womb here. So I do feel like they're trying to get back here um, as well as someone else here. They're really craving. I heard craving a brother here. For some of you, this child could have been conceived and lived on. Uh, and they expressed this to you, but they passed on. Um, so again, I'm, I'm really sending my love and healing energies to you, all three. Um... I feel like for a lot of you, the baby is going to look just like you, especially in your childhood here. Or your child could have looked just like you here. Um, yeah, I feel like for a lot of you, you can hear their voice here. You could be clear, very clear. Uh, sorry, very clear audience here. Some of you, you could see visions here. I heard a star galaxy here. Uh, some of you could look up to the stars here. Um, or that's where they are at this time here. Star seed, star bean here. Um, I'm also getting Andromeda here, Lyran, Cyrus. I heard Galactic. Here, these could be any um, here that you resonate with here or you feel here. Also, feel like for some of you, like you could feel their touch as well. You could have like ignored it one time or found it um, like unpleasing here, but I feel like they reach out and touch you quite often here. I also feel like for some of you, you could be loners here, but it's like when you achieve something, you can feel like someone else like cheering for you as well. And you're not sure who it is. And I feel like it's your spirit lady here definitely um, cheering you on here or giving you joy here. So they they um really help um, put a smile on your face here. Um, so sometimes you could feel like you're just happy out of nowhere or joyful out of nowhere. And you feel like you don't have a reason to be. I feel like they are present here. Um, I heard white dove or white feathers here. It could be when they are communicating with you here as well. It could be another sign, another symbol here. Something significant happened in three months. They might have a message for you in three months. I'm also getting something financially could be happening for you um, in three months. Um, that will have you stable here for generations on here. So I do feel like you guys are going to have, I heard the time of your life before you actually settle down with someone um, and bring these babies in. Um, so yeah, some of you could be having um, uh, baby fever here. Um, but it's saying like, is that something you really want here? Some of you, you know, it's not really what you really want, but you have those little moments. I was just fine. We all do. We have those little moments where we have baby fever. Oh, you know, uh, and then we're like, oh no, I can't do it. And I also feel like you, so I feel like you will be lucky enough to um, have as much time as you want here until um, it happens for you. Um, also feel like for you your uh child will be very connected to their grandparents um here or you will get a lot of help from your parents here with this child here some of you might um have some sperm 
donors here, but I still feel like you will get support here. Their family could know that this is something they're doing here. They might not be involved, the parent themselves, but their um, parents might be involved here, uh, which I'm getting a very, very genuine vibe from them. So I feel like this is going to be like good. Um, can I get some more energies here for pile two or their parents taking that into account? At this time, we're getting a no, but any other energies that could be surrounding this. Um, for some of you, this could be um, adoption. Some of you could be bisexual or you could like the same sex. Nothing wrong with it. Um, and you and that person could in the future be adopting a child or, you know, getting a sperm donor for you and your partner here. Yeah, for a lot of you, I feel like you know your spirit babies are present and you call upon them and some of you don't here, but it could be and maybe a good idea here to converse with them here because uh, I feel like you will build an even stronger and better bond um, before they actually um, get here. And I also feel like for most of you, your child will be like your best friend. I do feel like you'll still be able to set discipline and um, stern uh, ground and firm energy here, but for the most part, it's, <laughs> they're going to be um, your best friend, you're going to have a very open relationship, open communication with your child, which I'm loving it, I'm loving it, I'm loving it. <laughs> Season. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Trap. I hear this. I don't know why I heard suburban. Some of you are going to be having this child when you are moving, like physically locating. Some of you are having it um, when you get married or before you get married. Some of you, your children will be walking down the aisle as your flower girl um, here or something like that. I also feel like you will have your child will be like a scientist or they will be really good in uh, science. They will get very good grades in school here. I don't know why I heard I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States. They might have a really cute voice too as well. Um, I feel like you guys, you've been trying, some of you have been trying for a child already and it's just not happening, just not happening. It might happen for years down the line, but you will probably be appreciative. Like, well, I'm glad it actually didn't work out till then um, or something like that. So yeah, um, some of you, your um, child could be your to be lawyers here. I'm seeing scientists. I'm seeing lawyer. I'm seeing doctor. I'm seeing something really big here. Um, but yeah, some of you, you um. It's going to be kind of like you're having a water birth because you're going to produce a lot of fluids here. Some of you might pass out. Your person might even pass out when receiving the news. I don't really feel like it's mainly receiving the news, but during actual, like, when you're going into labor here. So take it how it resonates. Or, um, for, it's like some of you this, some of you that. Um, Some of you are going to crave a lot of weird foods. You're going to be the power who craves a lot of weird foods during your pregnancy here. Uh, some of you, I'm seeing you're going to be really attracted uh, to tomatoes here. I heard spinach here. I heard coffee. I heard coffee and tea mixed together, so I don't even know about that. <laughs> I don't. Um... I also feel like this baby is going to slow a lot of you down here. Which is will probably be a good thing thing for you. I heard ADHD. Some of you could um, um have, and I feel like this baby will help you with that here. So I'm getting this word. This baby will calm you down, slow you down here. And I also feel like they will get you to be more communicative. You could be an introvert, and they will cause you to be um an extrovert, probably because you have to deal with them very often, raise them, discipline them, um you know, play with them and stuff like that. So they're gonna help you with that. I feel like also you guys will spoil your child here. So you might even sabotage yourself because later on you might regret it like, oh my gosh, I shouldn't have spoiled them. And so they are probably going to be a mommy's girl, mommy, uh, mommy's uh, or daddy's girl or uh, mom's boy or something like that. 
um, but I do feel like this this is going to be very successful during this pregnancy year, um, and you might like to go out in nature a lot during your pregnancy year. This is something I'm also seeing. Some of you might drink a little wine during your pregnancy. Look at that shh, silence. Some of you might drink a little wine or something during your pregnancy, which they say is fine, so nothing wrong. Do your thing, girl, okay? Um, I also feel like for a lot of you, you're going to know right away that you're pregnant. Like, hmm, pregnancy talk, there it goes. Like, when you take your test and you pee on it six, like, it's probably not even going to fill up or way it's going to yeah, two lines immediately. <laughs> um, so that's pretty much all I'm getting here for you. I uh, hope that gave it, you guys clarity. Hope you got something out of that. Thank you so much for those stopping by. I hope to see you guys around next time. Okay, peace. Pile four, welcome to your readings, love. You chose a money card. Are you currently pregnant at this time? We have abundant union. Two of cups. Wow. Five of pentacles. Ten of cups. The Ten of Wands here. The Four of Swords. And we have your not for everyone. Embrace your weirdness. Face your true north. Yes, you guys are currently pregnant. And you and your partner is going to be happy. You guys, I feel like you guys are already with your partner here. And you guys are planning, plan this here. And for a lot of you, plan this. Even despite, because some of you could be financially struggling. But it's like, you guys aren't worried about that here. You guys could be have a lot of faith here i'm feeling um i also feel like some of you like your family and stuff wanted this here um so you're also do you're doing this to please you your partner and your family like everybody wanted this everybody was rooting for it so you guys are going along with it um some of you uh, maybe you didn't plan it here but you guys are going to be very like happy about it here i heard six months here or some of you could be here um some of you, this is around a month here, but I also feel like during this pregnancy, your some of your signs or symptoms could be like a lot of farting, a lot of gassing, a lot of bloatness here. Um, you might like to wear a lot of blankets here or throw blankets here. You could be the type to have like a pregnancy pillow here. I'm getting as well here. Um, also feel like you are going to be wanting to do a lot of activities here once the baby is born here um, or grow up here. You guys will be have a lot of family time here. I'm getting a really family oriented vibe here, which I'm loving here. Um, I feel like for a lot of you, like some people don't understand you and your partner, like your relationship, your connection together. Some people could think like, it's not a match, but you and your person internally, deep down inside, know you guys are a match, but on the outside, it might not look like it. Some of you could have, like, different religions, or you could have totally different looks and have racial relationships here. Um, one could dress very outrageously, and one seems normal, um, and things of that nature, and people are like, how in the, what in the, <laughs> but you guys, you have no care in the world here. Um, I do feel like for some of you, you're having, oh my gosh, this is, this is, I like this. I don't think I've heard of this before or saw this, but you could be having or conceiving your baby in nature here. So I'm really getting that here in nature, uh, in the grass here, this could be in a field, in the forest, wherever it's tall grass or weeds or something like that growing and people probably don't even, that can't even see here. Um, that's very dope. I like that. Um. But again, some of you could be financially struggling at this time, but I feel like um, maybe five, when your baby, your child is five months, um, that you will start being, you and your partner will start being able to um, really be financially set, uh, set to get things going here. Um, I feel like a lot of am animals will be attracted to you during your pregnancy here, so don't be surprised when a lot of animals come up and try to smell your stomach, lick your stomach, or jump on you. So kind of be cautious. Some of you could have pets. Uh, you don't want them, you know, putting too much pressure on your um baby here i'm seeing i heard sonic um so i'm not sure how that would be significant maybe you guys are going to be eating a lot of sonic or maybe a lot of fast foods or something like that during your pregnancy here um i'm also getting to kind of mix it up make sure you get some enough vegetables in as well here uh, a lot of green foods a lot of green maybe juices or something like that uh i do feel like for a lot of you you're gonna um for the most part, you're going to be wearing, like, dresses or gowns or something like that. You're going to, like, not like clothes. <laughs> you're going to want to wish you could be naked. <laughs> um, so I'm seeing that as well. Um, some of you might, like, 
steal weird haunted house or something like that or just like have your oh yeah like you like you like you have the fierce you're the free spirited power like you have no fear in the world at all um <laughs> you're just going out on a limb um you also might be again very active during your pregnancy like i don't get that you will be exhausted a lot or lazy or anything like that um for other piles i got that but for you you're trying to do everything and everything you might get in a night by certain people like oh ma'am ma'am um, you can't do that. You're pregnant and you're like, I'm pregnant, but I'm not, uh, disabled. Like, <laughs> so yeah, that's you here. I'm seeing here. You could also wear like a lot of, uh, warm, thick socks or fuzzy socks, furry socks or like furry shoes or something like that. Long socks here. I'm getting as well here. Um, you could wear a lot of, um, our aprons. So maybe you're going to be really cooking too as well or something like that. Um, uh, some of you could wear like head wraps i'm seeing like i'm gonna really want to wear um head wraps during your pregnancy here uh, some of you might like cut your hair during this pregnancy you could wear or maybe live in a very hot climate here and you're like just forget it here and i feel like you're gonna look really good here too either way with hair wow any hair you're looking good here um I heard cornbread, corn fed. <laughs> so maybe that is well here. I do feel like your partner is going to be all over you while you're conceiving and going into labor. They might kiss you a lot here. They might wipe your forehead for you. They're going to be holding your hand here during it. They're going to be rubbing your back here, giving you massages. They're going to be spending the night in the hospital with you. Um, for those who are going to the hospital, because again, with some of you, you're out in nature with it, okay? Um, and you might bring you some pillows with you. I heard a neck pillow. <laughs> some of you could live in the country here, so maybe that's why you are having it out in nature. You could be having it in your backyard, uh, having your child in your backyard here. I feel like some of you, you're going to be very active as well sexually with your partner during your pregnancy. You said six weeks. What? Who? What did doctor say? I didn't hear it. Um, <laughs> oh, gosh. You also might be lighting a lot of sage here. Your baby is going to be used to uh, sage or like sage as well here. I'm getting for those of you who are really like spiritual or you just like sage. Um, surprisingly, you didn't choose pile five with the sage on top. Maybe some of you are going to go over to pile, pile five. Maybe if you are attracted to that as well. Um, not forcing anyone to go over there, but if you feel drawn, go over there. Um, any other energies here for Pile 4? Are you currently pregnant at this time here? Or any other energies? We got a yes. Glory! Yes! This is such a blessing here. You guys are going to praise. I heard Yahshua or whatever it is you believe in. You guys are praising to them because of this here. Um, I just heard, this is number one. Sex, power. I let me go. Oh, this is number oh, oh, oh. Yeah, you guys are gonna really, really enjoy this pregnancy here. You're gonna like being pregnant here. Some some women don't like like the feeling of pregnant. They feel uncomfortable and stuff like that. You're gonna love it. I also feel like you're going to love the glowiness of being pregnant. You might also wear like a lot of uh, makeup with it as well. Like you're going to be taking a lot of uh, pictures here. Some of you are getting professional pictures here with your family or your baby and stuff like that. Um, so I love it. I love it. I love it for this pile. Yeah, you guys, you might have really good. You still might have good knees. You might have a Megan the Stallion knees here. You still can do some squats and everything with this guy. <laughs> Some of you are, I heard, surrogate. You could be a surrogate here. And if you are, I feel like the couple will be taking very, very well good care of you. You might be living in their mansion for the time of you being pregnant. Maybe even five months after that here. Yep, look at that bounty. And that maybe could be how you are financially going to be secured uh, um, and set. Some of you are like, you're just... You're, you know, living your life, blah, 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 and you're financially, you know, you're having a hard time. And here comes someone who's like, we want you to be a surrogate for our baby. And you're like, eh, I don't know. And then you decide that you would. Next thing you know, they done got you rich and wealthy. And you're like, well, okay, then. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, man. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah, you guys are going to cry because of the news here. Um, some of you, I hope this is not everyone's situation or anyone's situation. For some of you, like once afterwards, you'd be a serial killer, you get the money, da da da. A few miles down the line, you might not be a part of this family anymore here. Some of you will, like, still, because it's still technically your, um, I think, I don't, I'm not sure how it works. I still feel like it's technically, you still have a say to it, still your child here. So, excuse any noise in the background, you guys. We have other people living in the home here. Five on five, sick and be here. Um, but yeah, so that's what I'm seeing. Some of you will still be a part of this here, um, and live on to be wealthy with this couple. Some of you, um, it's going to be an extended, um, short period of time. Um, so yeah, I hope that gave you clarity. I hope you got something out of it. Thank you much, love, for stopping by, and I hope to see you next time. Okay, peace. Pile five, welcome to your readings, love. If you chose the sage here, are you pregnant? Currently pregnant at this time? Excuse me. We have the ace of swords. We have fling thing. We have ten of swords. We have the ace of cups. We have the ace of wands. We have the devil, the tower, the moon. I feel like for a lot of you, you had a dream about being pregnant with this person or your partner here. Um. We have the Five of Cups, the Eight of Wands, You're Not Alone, Isolation, Physical Connection, and Community. I'm getting a no for this pile here, and I feel like the divine is protecting you here because it's not meant for you to have children with this person, or it wouldn't be a good idea to have children with this um, person here. Ooh, yeah, they're they're trying their best to protect you here. You can keep trying, like maybe you keep trying with this person, trying and spirit is like block, 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 block. Like they're defend they're on defense. <laughs> I'm sorry, but spirit's on defense. They're like, you know, they're hitting little Kim dance moves. If any of you know that dance move here, like that's how spirit <laughs> I'm sorry, spirit, like that's how spirit is doing right now. They're like, uh uh, they're not happening here at all. I do feel like you and your person are very, very beautiful, handsome people and that you would make some beautiful babies here. But at the end of the day, it's not about making a beautiful baby. Or you want to make sure you be careful who you have children with here. Five, 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 six. And this be here. I do feel like this will cause a change in your life, but not in a good way here. Uh, this will cause you a tower moment here. And you will regret this strongly here. We got the moon and the five of cups. Two cards about regret here. Um, and I feel like some of you, you could be feeling lonely or you're like you're wanting this out of loneliness. Um, maybe you feel like this child will, um, you know, soothe you or cause you to stop being lonely here. Um, but I feel like it's better to move on from this situation here so that you can proceed and get better here um, and start anew, start afresh. You see all these aces here. We got the ace of swords, ace of wands, the ace of cups. Spirit is wanting you to move on and start something new. We also have the eight of wands here. So you could like, you could be stuck on someone, but you could be ignoring a new lover here. And Spirit is like, please respond. Please respond to that new person. Uh, some of you, maybe the new person hasn't came in yet. And they're like, go over there. Someone's coming. Go over there. Like, <laughs> Yeah, I heard like you're sleeping on yourself here. Yeah, take a spiritual bath, like some sage, and get rid of this person's energy here. You don't want this here. I don't know why I heard demon child. Like, you don't want a child by a narcissist here. Um, I don't know if they will have any tendencies like your partner, or if once they're born here, that this could be a way for this partner of yours to take control here. Um, or they probably won't give the child the best lifestyle here. Though you, I know, I'm pretty sure you would do your best here. But there's still something missing here. People don't realize there's still something missing. It's very, very important to have a two-parent household here. Because um, some children, they grow up, they feel a little empty without ever having a father or without ever having a mother. Of course, over time, they get used to it and, you know, move on. But that will be always something, a void that's missing. It will always be present. It will always be there. Um... So I feel like if you really want a child, move on from this person and have it with the right person kind of energy here. Spirit is saying, like, they're not the only person in the world here, especially to have a child by. They're not here. 
and also that you have to find self-love and fulfillment within um, and stop trying to maybe have your partner or a baby or anyone else fill that void. Uh, so you guys really have some work to do here. I'm not trying to sound like offensive or harsh or nothing like that. I just want to bring healing and truth to you guys here. So if you feel deep down in your spirit, your soul, and your intuition that this resonates with you, please take these actions here. Any more further energies here for Pile 5 Love is not even at this time. We already clarified it's a no, but... Ooh! Come on, spirit is speaking here, and I can't make it up. I'm shuffling it on camera. I can't make it up here. I know some of the cards I already pulled, but... Leave! Okay, leave, 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 leave immediately. Okay, go with the flow, you know, surrender, release control, wait, things. And a lot of meditation will work for you and clear your mind. Take a detox from social media, uh, especially if you're seeing a lot of pregnant people um, and babies. It's giving you baby fever and it's triggering you and messing with you here. Yet we got retreat. You guys need to go on a good old retreat, a good vacation, have a me day, spa day, you know. And stuff like that so you guys can get back in the groove here and for a lot of you this might change your mind like oh yeah i don't want a child with this person or i don't want a child at this time or i don't need this this and that to fill my voids um yeah replenish your energy here and get back up to a high vibration here um i'm loving it i heard schizophrenic so nothing wrong with that but if that's something you have some of you can want to see a therapist um here especially maybe around this here some of you um Maybe you did lose a child before and maybe you're trying to like replace that child or something like that. The spirit is saying, you know, Wusa, breathe here. Uh, some of you could be taking parental classes here. And I do think you can still take it even if you are not having a child at this time or if you had like a child before here. So if that's something you're interested in doing, you know, just to kind of give you, fulfill your fantasies or something like that with actually, you know, with actually not doing it with the wrong person, that will also be something for you here. We have juggle, results, develop fruit here, eating a lot of fruit here to also maybe raise your vibration here or have you in a good energy I'm seeing here. Um, mint as well is something nice like good i'm seeing hiatus going on a break here you guys can be very stressed here also knowing that trapping someone um with pregnancy whether you are a male, male or a woman is not going to get that person to stay what do we have unite it's not going to get that person to stay here and spirit what i say spirit is protecting you um so they say keep it low key here stop telling you know your business here <laughs> But what you're trying to do and stuff, you're sabotaging yourself here and go within Centre. So I hope I gave you guys clarity. I hope you guys something out of that. Thank you much for stopping by and I hope to see you next time. Okay, peace.